what is doing? Let you welcome back to another episode of Half Court News. And as always, you know we got an shots online for today's stories. So without any further ado, let's jump into it. All right, for the first story of the day, we're gonna be talking about John Morant, Glam Morant. So you telling me this man made the comeback, came back from his suspension, just to get injured for the rest of the year? That is tough as tits. That is insane. How the hell do you make the comeback and then you got to sit out the rest of the season regardless? Like, that's fucking insane, yo. That is just funny as hell. So now we didn't even get to see Job play for real. He played for like, what, like a couple weeks and some change? And now he out for the season. So now we got to see, we got to wait the season and we got to see for him if he can make the comeback going into 2024. That is tragic. No paddock. But all jokes aside, though, speedy recovery for my boy John Morant. Glad Morant. Speedy recovery. And then we're going to move on to the next story, though. And last but not least, we got to talk about, once again, possible Dick Rod Juice World Challenge news. We got to talk about how this man, Kid Cudi, is not going to be featuring him on the Insano Deluxe or the Insano Bass album that will be dropping. I believe it's this Friday or it's the upcoming Friday. Either way, Cuddy said that he was trying to drop it. He was trying to drop All Life Long. And he, was, he also has some other features as well. He's got that. He got some stuff with Yachty. He's got some stuff with uh, X. But the big thing I talk about is the fact that Juice isn't on this hoe. And the fact that the label is basically saying, listen, you could drop it after the fact, but we got to drop it first. And once again, grade A, once again, Lil Baby is on some L shit. They're on some fuck shit. They keep on delaying this last album. They lied to me in that last few banger videos to end off the year. They're on some lying shit. They're on some fuck shit. They're on some skeevious shit, devious shit, trifling shit, wildin' shit. Like, bro, why the fuck is this not dropping? And then even Cuddy saying, like, I don't care. I was not told by any of this shit. I wasn't told about none of this shit. I, it's not dropping on my end. It's going to drop on their end, and that's it. That's fucked up how Baby and them were doing this with the album. They gave us one little goof-ass single, Lace It, with Eminem to end off the year, and that's it. So, Baby lied once again. Like, he lies more than my ex-girlfriend, which is fucking crazy, bro. He be lying more. He be lying. Oof. Man, fuck it, bro. I ain't tripping, though. We gonna get it one day or another. I'm probably gonna be 30 by the time this hoe actually drops, but... That's all the news for the day. Thank you guys for sliding. If you made it through the end of the video... Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Always helps the channel out. Comment down below, triple L, because you know we're always living like Larry or BAT bat with the bad emoji because you know these bitches always trifling. And once again, with all that being said, Santa LH, never lose hope. And I'm going to catch y'all in the next video. Peace. Yeah.